All right, guys. Today we are gonna be reacting to racist lady things. Caucasian men can't suffer racism. This is gonna be crazy. Let's jump in. I think you. I think just like you, you can't be. You can't technically be racist towards a white man or sexist towards a man. I think it can be insensitive and it can be rude and hurtful. Wait, so. But I think on. because because my core belief that power dynamics play a lot into mm. how the cultural significance of what something means are then, women a minority maybe not minority numerically but definitely i wouldn't say we're oppressed but i would say and you can't compare struggles why not isn't that the everyone genesis everyone of has feminism? everyone has their own struggles yeah that's Every why they should be compared their own struggles mm -hmm. but, well i mean but if you say that there's a power dynamic right there could have been tons of struggle to get to the power dynamic, right? So becoming powerful, becoming king, maybe there was a big struggle there. Is she going to make still the comparison, though, that this person's more powerful than I think there's more obstacles that? for one compared <clears throat> to the other. And so aren't, isn't that a judgment? A judgment. Like it's an assessment, and, and so you are comparing okay, maybe, struggles? Okay, maybe so, yes. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't say women are oppressed, especially when compared to black women. Um, but I would say that... They definitely have more obstacles than men. That doesn't mean men don't have struggles. And I think you can say hurtful things that mm. are considered sexist to a man, but in a, a cultural significance, they don't compare. Two, two things really quick. Uh, so just definitively, can you be sexist towards a man? I don't think I have a definitive answer. I think it's a gray area. Mm. I don't think it is. Okay, well, I think we it's a yes. I think it's a yes or no. I disagree. Okay. Can well, I give a hypothetical situation? Sure. Yeah. Just say that there was a little utopia of women all existing together, no men whatsoever, a little colony of women. And then a man walks in and they all point guns at him and they arrest him, they lock him up and they put him in yeah, a prison and they say, this That's is because hypothetical. you are a man. And then every day they walk into his cell, they throw feces on him and they say, that's because you're a man. Would that be sexist? Yes, but that's not the world we live Wait, in. That's on. a hypothetical. Let, okay, fine, yeah. I'll ask this. Uh, and I do want to credit Andrew for this one a little bit. Um, if, if a business that was owned by men didn't want to hire a woman just because, just because she's a woman, not for some other reason, she wasn't qualified, although she was, but uh, would that be sexist? If yes. you didn't want to, is it sexist for women to cross the street when there's three men coming towards her? No. At night? No. What? Because they're men. It's not sexist. But this leads back to my other point. So I just think, to be clear. I think, yes, the man, the three men walking down the street can be hurt by that and say, well, why don't, why don't she trust me? But I think in, in the grand scheme of history and culture and power dynamics, there is a I'll reason why grant, the woman I'll even that grant way. that there's a bigger impact on women to, for a company to refuse to hire them because they're women. I'll grant it. But is it still sexist? For a company not to hire a woman. Because, because she's a woman. She's a woman. Yes, it's sexist. It's sexist. So... How is it not also sexist for a woman to cross to the other side of the street because she has a bias mm -hmm. against men that they are, they are a potential violent threat? Mm -hmm. How is that not sexist? Because like I said before, I think in the grand scheme of things, culturally, it, there's mean? a different Wait, significance. What does that mean in a, in a big grab of things? What does that mean? Like, that sounds like such a cop-out phrase hold on so i'll grant that there's varying levels of sexism right mm -hmm. so for example um choosing to someone because of their sex you would agree that or well i suppose you would only think it would be uh sexist if a man a woman because she's a woman but a woman who for um, who's the one who tried to kill andy warhol what if it's a black woman who's crossing the street and it's three, three Native American men. <laughs> that's actually crazy. <laughs> Keep that's Keep not that's a crazy clean. hypothetical. It's a black woman says she, she sees three Native American men walking towards her, and she crosses the street to I avoid do think them. that's a crazy hypothetical question because ah, that takes into a whole... That's, that's, that's right there. That's the innate racism right there, man. That's, she's racist. That's what she is.
whole other complex lot of layers that include a lot more cultural significance than. Hmm. Yeah, so what's wait, the answer? Yeah, like, it depends on how wait, 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 wait. Actually, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. wait. I, got, I got this. By the way, Techno Trooper, we will come back to your TTS, but I want to get through this conversation first. So we will get into the biggest struggles men have when it comes to dating. It's like, uh, see, oppression Olympics. But it could be wait, how they're dressed, on. too. Wait, wait. So, question for you. Okay. Perhaps using the sort of different scenario is not the best. If there was a company that was operated by women and they refused to hire men, would this be sexist? Yes. Wait, I thought you can because be sexist. There's... I thought you can be sexist towards men. But crossing street and uh, taking the people to work in a I've company two different things. Because then in that case, I think if there's a whole room of women, I think because that's a similar hypothetical question to what you asked. If it's all women, and then that's, it's like, well, I guess also there are, there are companies well, that are just women. what about the history of power dynamics? We have I to know, take in the whole you... history of women. And you know, as you know, women have been far more oppressed than men. So if that is the case, no, no, how could sexist. a woman? Because yeah, it's I not do sexist, think, I right? do think just like there are Hispanic groups and like black groups for different communities and things that where people like like film production companies or like mm -hmm. um, unions even, they, they advocate for a specific group of people, right? And so if it is just sure. a group of women and they exclude a man for that reason, then sure. My grandma's in a women's club yeah, and but, they advocate but for that's women. Putting, but then you're disregarding the entire history of women. Exactly. What do you mean? Well, I have so, a better question. No, okay. Why yeah, I yeah, can't yeah, speak? Well, hang on, hang on. No, yeah, why? Russia, 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 Russia. You have to be quiet on this one. Yeah, this is the, I know you want to be a little hero, but you have to be quiet on this one. Only she's speaking like for 30 minutes. No, I do I'm sorry, the attention's not 100% on you right no, this second. No, but I do think other women should speak. Yeah, and they have so. been. But, but so I'm just, I'm just asking, okay. I'm just asking a couple of follow-ups here. <laughs> I right? can go back to this. <laughs> like I, no, actually, she needs a break. I, she shared with me I'm that sorry. she needs a break. She like, did take a break. Is it yeah. like two questions and then I need a break? I'm just curious about, no, about just, the answer. No, I just no. want to hear what other Here's people have to say Here some other girls well. also yeah, wants no. to speak. I want to hear what they have to say, then too. Let's listen. I also yeah. want to hear what you have to say. So that's why I'm Thank asking you, you the let's question. Let's listen to other women as well. Yeah, I know. And we will. Even the Russian girl can understand that she needs to be saved. That's the language. That's why she's saying like, no, somebody, uh, somebody can, can comment. The reason is that she's just getting exposed for her bad belief. That's what it is. Bill, as soon as I'm done listening to your answer to the question. Wait, didn't you get all butthurt because you had like 30 seconds on the Charlie Kirk thing? We're giving you. I wasn't butthurt. Okay, you weren't I butthurt. I said rightfully like... so. I said yes, I should have gotten voted off, and I did. Yeah, how long, by the way, how long was the shoot? The Jubilee thing? Yeah. Like two hours. Two hours, okay. And you got like one minute of screen time, basically? Yeah, because I wasn't logical. How about I make a deal? I'll ask one last question, that's it. Okay. And then I'll ask like 50, but go ahead. Okay, <laughs> I'll ask one last question. Okay. For the next 20 um, minutes. Is it, well, two. It's gonna be two, but it'll be very fast. Do you agree with me that, that you can be prejudiced without it being racist? Meaning, if, um, if like a group of black people hate white people because they're white, they're not being racist, but they're still being prejudiced. Like it's prejudicial, right? I think, I think in being racist or being prejudiced, but I think you can be prejudiced without being racist. racist. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so they would be being prejudiced in a situation like that. For what? What was the scenario again? If they just hate you because you're white. Her brain right now is just about to explode. Yes. Yeah, that's prejudice, right? Yeah. Can you tell me why morally being prejudiced is better than being racist? <laughs> I don't think one's... Well... There we go. That's a good question that I don't have a specific answer for. There we go. You should think about that. Mm -hmm. There we go. I'll think about that. I just sent two should links. Um, all night long. So... <laughs> So I'm a little confused because it seems like you're leaning towards women cannot be sexist towards men or you just can't be sexist towards men in general, it sounds like. But you did seem to concede that in the example I provided that so you... So disrespectful. Look at, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. So disrespectful. You have to call that out, man. You have to call that out, bro. You have to put an example in a panel like this. You have to call this out. You cannot simply let us lie. Look at See that, that in the example I provided, look, 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 look. that you, so this, this scenario I provided. This is what they call the, the, the pretty privilege. She you knows she's, she's like a six, and she can get away with it. Provided that. Look, look, look. Are you. 
Well, yeah. I mean, he said he was going to ask two questions. Let me move on. <laughs> oh, man, like, oh, man, this is cringy. Yeah, he, he said that. Is it, is it the and then you said you were going to ask questions, job. and I said I yeah. wasn't going to answer it because I want to hear other women speak. She just doesn't want to engage. Is it because you just don't want your worldview to be challenged because it will crumble under scrutiny? Yeah, of course. Look at that. Look at that. There you go. I think. Is it, by the way, this is, um, I mean, my line of questioning has been fairly milk toast and polite, but uh, I do find it interesting that when you get even the slightest degree of perhaps questioning or pushback on your worldview, you refuse As to that's engage. That's not been happening this entire time, and I've been answering the entire time. Well, you're not really allowing me to continue on with the exchange, so. And I don't think it's fully been settled, so. Do you know what stonewalling is? Do you think it's healthy to do that in a relationship? What? Stone what? Stonewall. Answer, okay, I'll bring it back to a dating related. Do you think stonewalling in a relationship is toxic? Answer the question. Yes. yes. Mm. What the hell is that? It's yeah. like refusing, <laughs> refusing question. to... Address any problems, anything that's yeah. wrong. What? Anything you guys might face as a couple, I'm assuming. Yeah. So, like, if you guys argue, if there's something Speaking you guys, the if you guys are like arguing, and if you guys just choose not to talk about it, or if you guys just want to like push it under the rug, that's basically what stonewalling is: not addressing or wanting to fix the issue. I mean, you can do that if you want to break up. Right. Like, you have to have communication in a relationship. That's you know what they, you know what they say in that because that's what they do. <laughs> they stonewall. That's what they do. Before they usually break up with the relationship, that's what they do. They start looking for problems and they start basically just brushing it under the rug and that way they can just have an excuse of why not stay in the relationship. That's why they know what it is. Right now, this is a very good sign. Very good sign of actually passive aggressiveness right here. That's why it's just it's yeah. toxic. Oh, okay. It's toxic. Hmm. <laughs> What do you go. think about that? There you go. Is stonewalling good or bad in a relationship? If it's a relationship you're trying to sustain, are we friends right now? Are we like in a relationship? Like this is not something that I want to. Like this is not grass I want to water right now. I want to move on, and that's what I'm doing. Oy, 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 oy. Then break up. You can't really. Like, <laughs> you can't really just be like, well, I've I've put something out there, but I'm not prepared to defend it. I don't think you can be, you're, you were essentially saying, you can't be racist towards white people. You can't be sexist towards men. I believe that's your position. Uh, you're trying to cloak it in this sort of vagueness of, well, there's black and white. But essentially, you, you, because you're, you would say emphatically and definitively, you could be racist towards women, yes? Racist towards or, women? Um, excuse me, I apologize. Guys, I want to make a statement. Oh I could God, not handle, God, I could girl, could not handle that boring yeah. questions. Yeah, she's just to say she's saving. She's not understanding boundaries. Folks, she's not understanding boundaries and she's just jumping in. Anymore. I'm yeah. falling in <laughs> sleep. I'm going home. <laughs> I, I love you all <laughs> bitches so much. Right, mwah, 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 mwah. Mwah. Touch my my donated $200. Wait, whose show is this? Are you permitted to run it and ask questions? Yes, just like I'm permitted to ignore them. I mean, you're under no obligation to answer any questions, but it sort of... Come on, Brian. Brian, 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 Brian. I'm sorry, buddy. I love your show. I love you and Andrew. But it has to be a point when you have to say, like, man, you have, you have to establish... You have to sacrifice one for the team. Just to establish frame. That's why the Russian lady just one up on you that that's what it is i'm gonna keep it honest uh 100 with you guys the russian lady just one up on you guys because he's not putting boundaries that's what happened it's super when andrew said she don't wanna she don't wanna engage she don't wanna be in, in good faith that's what it is that's what it is that's what it is right now bad faith to not want to engage with the conversation. Well, isn't this a group discussion for a reason, though, to your other perspectives? And I've been talking for the past, what, like, hour? Can other, well, do other women, know, do you guys want to say anything? You know, maybe if you kind of can just I, answered the I questions, I'd be speak? able, maybe if you just answer the questions. Going against you, they're asking you questions. That's why we can't speak right now, because they're asking you, not us. They're not directed towards us. Like, I would, we've, I think kind of, okay, so they know, so they know now. Pink hair and lady here on the right they know like I, I, i'm I, i'm not i'm not defending you in this one 
I'm not defending you this one. You're looking crazy. I like hear like the reasoning as to the statements that have been I made. I just feel like I've been I've been trying to explain my Okay, the uh, you're racist. I don't give a, I don't give a damn what you have to say. Let me know what you guys think. I will see you in the next one.